Hey everybody, um, I'm here today to talk to you about dishwasher cleaners. Now, dishwasher cleaners can be fairly expensive and if you just go to the store and you don't buy this one because it has a 50-50 rating of being the worst or the best and you want something that will work, you're looking at $65 a year plus tax. Of course that's without coupons but most people don't use coupons so I'm assuming you're spending $65 a year if you're cleaning it once a month. So the whole premise is dishwashers get dirty. They get a mineral buildup and they can also get an oil residue buildup. I never really noticed that type of problem but my dishwasher did need to be cleaned so I tried a couple things. The first thing I tried was vinegar. It worked, it helped, it freshened up the machine a bit. Not that the machine was really that funky or anything, it just very slight odor if any and it did work. However, I tried something the other day that was Amaze balls, okay? Citric acid. You have to wear gloves. You have to run it with your dishwasher empty. You have to put it on right away. This is not something you want sitting in your machine because it is an acid. So you put your gloves on, not latex gloves. They can't be a rubber glove like that you use for cleaning. It has to be non latex uh, or plastic glove and you scoop out one tablespoon and you put it in the machine and you run it. And my element for the first time ever was actually completely clean. My dishwasher, I didn't notice it really had a smell, but I guess it did because it just doesn't now. It came out perfectly clean and amazing, which means my dishwasher is also working better. It means that the sprayer nozzles got cleaned, the pump got cleaned because it circulated it around. Now you don't want to run this with dishes in the machine. That's not going to be good for your dishes. They use acid to etch glass when they're doing etched glass. So one tablespoon is all it takes. A two pound container like this would last you years. And if you feel like you need to run it more often, you can easily do so. Citric acid is also used in alpha hydroxy um, skin creams for removing the dead skin off your face. If you ever did try to make it, wow, do your research because you don't want to burn your face off, okay? Just do your research. I know it's done, but you have to pH test and everything to make sure that you're in the safe zone because there is a safe zone for that. It's also used for canning and other items. So just be careful with your skin, you know. If you spill it on the ground, I would probably vacuum it up because your vacuum isn't ever wet. Uh, if you have a wet dry vac, it might not be a good idea to vacuum it. And when you wash the floor, make sure you put just some baking soda and water to wash it first and then rewash it again to get the baking soda and water off because you want to neutralize the acid. So, you know, safety things being said, keep it out of the range of kids and pets in a properly sealed container. I would treat it as a drain cleaner kind of chemical that needed to be kept that safe. Now, like I said, this will last three to four years. This is Canadian Amazon. It's also available on American Amazon and of course it's cheaper. The price looks higher but it's a five pound container and it's in US dollars. So it, we don't want to buy this in Canada because the shipping would make it cost prohibitive. We're better off buying it from Canadian Amazon. And if you are going to buy these, double down on your savings here. Go through your Ebates. If you already have an Ebates, awesome. Instead of using affiliate links for me, 
I would rather see you use Ebates. Um, if you don't have Ebates, the link's below for Canadian and American Ebates. I have both. So you can join up if you don't have it. And every time you make a purchase, you get your percentages back. Um, as you can see, this is how it is here. And if you know you want to buy a few items that you saw, you just got paid, there's a few things you were thinking about buying, put them all on your wish list so you don't have to worry about the Ebates. Then go through Ebates once and do one big transaction and it will simplify your shipping and everything and make sure that you're over your $25 mark for free shipping if you don't have the Prime. So, yes, Ebates is a why leave the money on the table? And of course, it doesn't work just for Amazon. It works for lots of other places like Old Navy where they're, they have good clearance sales. And then if you use the cash back too, it's money in your pocket. That's really all I have for you today. So just use it safely. It's a great way to save a lot of money on this stuff. And I hope you all have a really great day. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.